Would you mind growing? I find this. Awesome, a huge tree. Well, that is actually fairly good because it gets me a lot of chances to get some uh, materials. But, uh, awesome, a huge tree. So, you can probably hear click, 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 click in the background. I know there's a way to do that automatically, but I, I don't know how. Uh, yeah, I know you can hear a bunch of just clicking and yawning and voices in the background too, I bet. Oh no, I don't know how loud my mic is because I, I can barely hear anything that's going on on my screen. So I, I don't know. I, I can hear it's just quiet, so I don't know if my mic is going to be obscenely quiet. I'm going to be very, very disappointed if it is obscenely quiet. I've never heard that before. I don't know if that actually, like, works. <sighs> I really kind of wish Decapitator was on, but that would make it easier. So this is fairly monotonous at the beginning, at least. Uh, once I, uh, since this is literally everything that's going on, I'm probably just going to, for the first couple episodes, include pretty much everything. Uh... Uh, and once we get later and more interesting stuff starts to happen, I'll edit out the, uh, slow and boring stuff. But yeah, see, we're getting tons of saplings, Yeah, I'm gonna guess a few apples and silkworms as well. Huge trees are good and bad. Good because they give you tons of materials, and bad because they're just so boring so yeah hopefully you're just watching for the commentary because that's all this video has for it maybe some uh, walkthroughs no I didn't lose that sapling good uh, maybe a bit of a walkthrough uh, w would you count this as a bit of a walkthrough I don't know this is let's play uh, I'm not really telling you how to do everything, but I am kind of showing you how. But, honestly, there's not really much that you can do in the beginning. I mean, you would have to understand, uh, the mod, like, what everything does before... Okay, awesome, another apple. Uh, you will have to understand, like, everything that happens in the mod pack. I have no idea what I'm trying to say. You'll have to understand what the stuff does within the mod pack to be able to play this. Because this is fairly complex. Okay. Oh, and if you can't tell, this is made by Bacon Donut. Yeah. I actually should say in the... By Bacon Donut, yep. So that's why you spawn with the Bacon and Donut. I'm just trying to, uh, keep track of everything that I need to do, because I have terrible memory. So... Oh! <gasps> okay, that's safe. Hopefully it doesn't despawn before we get down there. I bet it's gonna... I can't remember what the despawn time is. I think it's like five minutes. So, 14.50, so... If we're not down there by 255 it should be uh, done uh, despawned but if you just see the massive amount of saplings that we're getting yeah they must have upped the uh, drop rate for saplings and dropped it for apples since last time I've played because I'm getting tons more saplings and 
not nearly as many apples. Oh no, maybe, maybe I just had to change the lock. But yeah, uh, what the saplings I have right now? That's five pieces of dirt. That's easily another five pieces of cobblestone, and uh, to make a slab furnace, you only need six. Technically, you don't need six because you get some back. Well, you need six to be able to make it, but uh, like. It doesn't cost you six in the end. The initial cost is six, but you get, I think, one or two cobblestone back. I think it might only be one. Let's see. Six. Two. So you get 12 slabs, and it takes eight to make it. That means you have four. So you get two cobblestone back. So the end cost is only, uh, is only four cobblestone. So that's really awesome, actually. And you may be wondering why I'm not building this with slabs to, you know, conserve resources. Oh, no. Oh, that was scary. Oh. Uh. Not appropriate reaction because I just kind of walked off, so I saw it coming. Uh, no, 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 no. Build buckets. Uh, let's see. I need three buckets. We need to capture this water. Because we need water buckets to be it for two reasons. A, water. And second, we need to be able to make clay so we can make a crucible. Uh, and the crucible is really what we need to be able to get lava. So we need that to make a cobblestone generator. So yes, it's very important that we have water and water barrels and this is very very laggy I have no idea why it's laggy I think my internet connection is kinda bad uh, I'm actually recording in a different location than my first couple ones so if I'm laggy it's either because for some reason my laptop is being bad I don't know why that would happen because first time I recorded this this didn't really lag or, uh, and I think this is more likely, uh, it's just because my internet connection is kind of bad. So, yeah. Let's just break down the last of this tree. I hate how branchy this tree was because it made it very slappy for cleanup. Uh, just. Hardcore Parker. Yeah. I'm already running out of things to say. So. Yeah. Hooray for a good commentary! I wonder if I can... No, no, I can't. I was wondering if I could see the buckets from here and see if they were full. I'm worried because how long it took me to get my buckets up that they're not going to fill up because of this rain. I don't know. So, I'm going to keep the water buckets around for a little bit until we get furnace up, which should be fairly soon because tons and tons and tons of saplings. They definitely buffed it, uh, the sapling spawn rate and decreased the uh, apple spawn rate. Definitely, because there's I did not get nearly as many saplings uh, before. So this is so that's pretty good because this will drastically speed up uh, this mod pack. Okay, that's safe. We are getting a decent amount of apples, so I'm happy about that.
No! Oh, that could have been really bad. Uh, landed right next to the edge. And yes, awesome, they're full. I was just kind of worried because how long it took me to build them that they wouldn't wind up full. But luckily they did. Luckily they did. So, all I have left of this tree is just the random wood. And I might want to build an axe as soon as possible. Uh, if I get another big tree, I'm going to make an axe. Just because big trees are huge pain. I also probably want to expand this platform a little bit. Actually, maybe not. I don't know. I probably want to put a guardrail up. I don't know. If I do, I'm gonna do it off screen because there's nothing fun about that. I have no idea why I'm lagging. I hope, hopefully, uh, I am lagging. Hopefully, it doesn't cause a bunch of video glitches because, oh no, that would be really bad. Uh, give me a second. I'm not getting any huge spikes, so I don't know why it's lagging. I know rain is really laggy, but I normally don't really lag in Minecraft. It's A, I have a really good computer. B, uh, I shouldn't be, even when I did lag before, I shouldn't be anymore because now I'm running Linux, so I should be uh, running this much better. I don't know. <laughs> How many falls is that? Three? On that one tree? So we need 18 string, which we're definitely going to get. Yeah, no, I think they also up the uh, spawn rates for string since I last played. Maybe maybe my luck is different or something, I don't know. Yeah, no, we definitely got enough uh, string to be able to make a sieve. No, I forget what's more effective in... Uh, getting ores. I can't remember if it's saving cobblestone or dust. I'm pretty sure it's saving uh, cobblestone. Ooh, I also need to be able to make a hammer. But I think I have enough saplings. But yeah, just get rid of all this. Let's see. Divide by eight. So. I have enough saplings for seven dirt. And I definitely will have enough uh, cobblestone to make a furnace and a hammer and possibly break down uh, to a couple dust to be able to get the, uh, the uh, clay because that's what we need the water for to be able to make clay. And then we need some dust to be able to get bone meal. Hopefully... Oh god, I really hope that I get bone meal because that was possibly the slowest part of anything getting the bone meal. So hopefully I do get bone meal a bit faster. Uh, so I'll need seven bone meal and seven clay. That's why I made three buckets. Uh, so I'll get twelve clay. Actually, I can't remember. I probably would have been good with just two buckets, but I decided three for some leftovers. I don't know why. Because it's cooler. But anyway, it's so awesome. Uh, and... I'm probably going to expand this one more off to the side. Or maybe two more. I think two more would be the best bet. Just so we have enough room for the sieve and everything. <sighs> See, mobs spawn 25 blocks away. I don't want to make it large enough for mobs to spawn the other side. But eventually I'll have to just because everything. So just put this torch like right there. Light level 6, light level 9, light level 7. Okay, that's good enough for me. 
I won't be able to move those buckets till I get the clay, though, so that's gonna drive me a bit cl crazy. Because clay is not my first priority. My for first priority is, without a doubt, getting uh, some, uh, Just put that there. Uh, would be getting a uh, furnace up and running. So, yeah. Don't question my logic. Don't question my stuttery voice. Don't question anything. Be blind and submissive. Please, it would make uh, making these videos a lot easier for me. Uh, so just put the sieve right there. Now what I'm going to do is just make a ton of dirt. Oh, that this is going to be a pain. Can I... Will this... Don't lose the dirt. Will that block the water? Yes, it's blocking the water. Awesome. So, I honestly have not played this for very long before. Uh, safest place to sieve is just run on top because you instantly grab a, an awesome already got a spruce seed. We got three stone, you need four stone to make a cobblestone. Uh, but we will definitely have enough for a... Don't jump around those guys, or run. Any kind of activity seems to excite them. They like the jiggly bits. I just hit F4 accidentally, what does that do? I can't remember. But yeah, they like the jiggly bits. If you move your head too much, I, I I don't get them. They're weird. So just hop on top. I definitely want some grass seeds. There's <laughs> awesome, I'm just getting tons of seeds. They must have upped the drop rate for the seeds as well. So that's two cobblestone. Two out of six. Awesome, the rain's gone, so I can take this down. Two out of six. So actually, I want nine to be able to make enough clay. Uh, I might need to cut down a couple more trees. In fact, just because this tree's up, I'm gonna cut down. Now, uh, if you can't tell, twerking does not work for this tree. It it just takes forever to grow. So, it's going to be a little while till that grows. Uh, it's been like 20 minutes, so... I, I It might be long, it might be shorter, I have no idea. But yeah. I'm not going to do intros or outros, I'm just going to edit those in later. Because I am honestly too lazy to keep track of time. Uh, I'm just editing. I mean, I'm just gonna record until I literally can't. I'm just getting all the seeds. I just got pumpkin seeds and melon seeds from that. Awesome. So, yeah, no, slab furnace is just that. I should probably make a crafting station. That would probably been easier, but... Hey, I'm not very efficient at doing anything, so... Appropriate that that would carry over into Minecraft. I am going to start putting this stuff away to be safe. Because I don't want to lose that stuff. Because I'm a complete klutz and might just literally walk off the edge one of these days. <sighs> I 
feel really nervous just looking up because this is where I died my first game. Just walking off the edge over here. I'm definitely getting more saplings, so that that's good news. I'm going to make an axe. I'm, I'm just going to make a wood axe. I normally don't really make axes. But seeing how much this revolves around just breaking down trees... I'm just gonna make an axe. I might actually wanna make two axes, but eh. Now 